Hi team, welcome to a brand new week and I'm super excited about all the activity that's happening. So I thought I would take time and do our training today on connection calls and upline intro calls. And both of those really have the same outline to them. So when you um, have peak past and plugged and now you're doing a connection call, that's a call where someone's looked at some information and now you're gonna introduce them to somebody else so you are not um, the only person talking with them. So an upline intro intro, when you have somebody to do that call for you, you are going to kick it off by an edification process. You're going to say two to three nice things about the person that you're introducing um, your new connection to, and also two to three nice things about the person that you're connecting to the upline. And what that might look like is, hey, Sarah, this is um, Lindsay DeBoard. She's a white gold executive. In fact, she's a busy mama just like you, but she's very passionate about helping other people people, so I'm excited for you to meet her. And Lindsay, this is Becky. She's a great friend of mine. We've known each other since high school, and now she's very, um, not just curious, but serious about what we're doing. She has a lot of integrity, and in everything she does, she always hits a home run. So Lindsay, this is Becky, Becky Lindsay. So that would be the edification process. And then if you're the leader that's taking the call at that point, then you would say, hey, Becky, super glad to meet you. In fact, you're partnered with an amazing um, person with Lindsay. Everything she does is wholehearted as well. And so I know she's going to want to see you be successful at this thing, no matter what you decide to do with it. Um, but I would love to ask you um, what you're passionate about in general. Um, what do you do on a daily basis? What do you enjoy? And what are the things that interest you most about the information that you've looked at? And then after that, I'd love to share my story with you so you can um, know just a little bit more about me. Would that be okay? And then you let them answer the question. So pause. And listen and be a good listener. You're collecting intel. You're finding information that you're going to be able to match up, find some common ground so that you can really help them and give them um, the right information that they need to know. And then after that, then you go ahead and you share your story. You know, keep it just about anywhere from, you know, 10 to 30 seconds, short and sweet, but hit the highlights. You know, um, I typically like to say, you know, before Zizia, this is the way I was feeling. And then after Zizia, um, this is what I have found that has been different in my life, both physically and financially. And a lot of these things are also in the story going to talk about things that maybe they spoke about too and their interests. So after that, um, I asked them what they like best about the information that they saw. And then I asked them if they know enough to get started now. And if they do, great. And if they don't, I just ask them simply, so what questions do you need answered in order for you to start today? And then I just listen. And it's very important to just pause and actually let them answer the question. And so after I take a couple questions, or maybe they don't have any questions, then at that point, I just say, perfect. So would it be okay if I broke down some of the packs for you so that we could get you entered in the system and get you in the back office and get your things shipped off to you? And typically they'll say yes. And so then I break down the small, medium, and large pack. Um, and then as I'm doing that, who's ever on the other line, whose connection that is, would be writing down the information. So that's what an upline um, connection call looks like. And then an upline intro call is going to model the same formula. You're going to be put on the phone. There's going to be the edification process of each person. And then that person making the upline intro call will be on mute the whole time. And if there's anything you'd like to share with the person you're connecting them with, go ahead and text um, the upline so that they can be aware of what you'd like maybe um, us to talk about and, and touch on. So after that edification process, then I do the same thing. Hey, Becky, great to meet you. I'd love to hear what you're passionate about and what you're looking to do with Zisha. Welcome to the team. You couldn't be partnered with um, anyone better than Lindsay. Lindsay's going to help you um, knock this thing out of the park. And then after that, I'll go ahead and share my quick story with you so you have a testimony to stick in your pocket as you're reaching out and sharing with your friends and family. And then I listen to her story. I share my story. Then after that, I just ask, is it okay if I give you a couple tips to get you off to a great start? And then typically they're going to say, yes, of course. And then as I give those tips, I'm going to hit on PPP peak pass and plug, or maybe I'm going to hit on the importance of a home launch, or maybe I'm going to hit on the importance of downloading the team app. I'm going to give some great tips in order for this person to get off to a fantastic start. And then I'm going to ask them, is there any specific questions that I can answer for you? 
and then I'm going to pause and then I'm also going to uh, make sure that they know that they can be a part of our team app if they choose and that I highly recommend it and I highly recommend um, being on Facebook so that they can be in the private team page. So I hope that helps everybody. This was the outline and format for an upline connection call when you're helping somebody get started and also an upline connection call. After that person gets started, you're going to want to introduce them to at least two to four leaders so they have testimonies in their pocket so they can start attacking that contact list that you're going to help them make. So have a great week, everybody, and we'll talk to you soon. Thanks.